Hello there, Internet, and this is a second playthrough of Sword of the Stars The Pit. I realized last time might have been a little frustrating to watch me make all these horrible, horrible mistakes. Last time we played as the Marine, who has a might of 70. It turns out that's out of 100. So you don't want to put in more than maybe 10 or 15 points into might, because then it'll be totally maxed out by biomods and other equipment you might have, and so any extra points you dump in there will be totally wasted. And traps are found by using your brains, not the trap skill. That's just setting and using traps. It is brains that determine everything, and so you can dump points into brains, even with the marine, and come out totally fine. But the one thing that's really holding me back is not having enough recipes. So we're going to use the engineer um, I'm tempted to use the scout, but in fact the scout is a jack of all trades, master of none. This is more of a veteran player. I'm not there yet. I will eventually get to the point where I can use the scout effectively, but for right now, we're going to do engineer. So let's go ahead and jump in here. And here we are. Now theoretically this should be simple, right? So let's go ahead and set up our hotkeys. We have a knife, pistol, and not much else. So I still haven't found anything on the wiki to justify having the motion sensor around. It's kind of nice, but it doesn't really provide much benefit and it just takes up space. So I'm going to throw that away. Also in terms of repairing things, the things in your inventory could possibly degrade your equipment's durability. It'll reduce that number, so it's currently 60 out of 60. If I were to use this, it might drop it to 58, 55, 50. So you really want to make sure you only repair when you absolutely have to. And if possible, don't use the stuff you have in your equipment. Use a repair bay. So all good stuff to know. Kind of wish this was tutorialized, but all right, that's what the internet's for. So we're going to go through here. Another mistake I made was trying to clear the floor. That can be useful, but really um, it's a matter of balance. It's balancing how much you're using your equipment, how much you're degrading their durability, and anything you degrade that way, it's possible that it could really discount your survivability later. So again, something I kind of wish they had tutorialized, but basically that means as soon as I find a way down, I'm going to look at the map and see if there's really enough justification to go s and uh, explore the rest of the floor. Of course, it may be a moot point, as I'm already diseased. It's only a level 1 disease, though. I should just be able to sweat it out. Up, oh, and here we go. Here's the, uh, here's the way down. There does seem to be a lot of the floor left, but... Eh, well... Okay, so this is what I'm talking about. Is brain to 75. I could probably put in as many as five points into brains, but after that it might be a wasted stat. It might be better actually to put it into finesse and might to try to catch those up a little bit. Especially might if I'm going to be using a knife or the mechanical skill. So let's actually only have two points here. So we'll put one in brains just this once. Well, might want to get that as high as 80. Huh. I don't know. There aren't a lot of builds on the wiki that I saw, just general advice. So, we'll go ahead and up Finesse and Might, actually. And then for these... Well, now, let's see. So there's a difference between Knife and Blade. Oh, another mistake I made was saying that shotguns were assault weapons. Nope, they're rifles. Um, that seems totally arbitrary to me, but 
whatever. Shotguns or rifles. Good to know. Um, we're at 50 on pistols. Pistols all I have right now. So I'll go ahead and up that. Now, let's see, spending two points is also something you hardly ever want to do if you can avoid it. Um, right now the skill is low enough that um, I might actually have to for most of these, it looks like. Forging actually determines uh, how much or what quality of the stuff you find or how much of it. So if I can get this as high as 40, that'll help out a lot. If I get it to 80, that's even better, but 40 is good. So, hey, there we go. 40. Okay. Um, that basically, theoretically, would bump us up a tier on whatever we find next. And then, let's see. Electronics is already pretty good. Let's go ahead and boost mechanical to make up for not as high a might skill as we might want. Um, decipher is already 50, but putting two points in it seems really sketchy to me. Most everything else is going to be two points. Okay, so there's knife here, which we can upgrade. But I think everything else being two points, I'm going to have to use... Oh. Well, it's a toss-up between medical and pistol. I guess we'll go ahead and put pistol. Okay. So let's stay on this floor until we're done with this disease. Just to make sure we don't go down the floor with too bad of a disadvantage. Well, he's really bad with this. Try not to die on the first floor. That'd be really embarrassing. Who needs a marine? Huh. Disease has progressed to level 2. That's not good. I kind of want the disease not to... Okay, there we go. Disease reduced. That's good. Forging. Theoretically, you'd find something wonderful. Oh, food pellet. That's almost wonderful. Yeah, see, moving the skill up to 40. Oh, man. Disease just keeps worsening. Okay, let's, uh... It's the pistol here. It was self-defense. Alright. Now, I don't necessarily want to clear a floor... Now there is something you can do called shadow boxing, where basically you just attack an empty square over and over. Um, I just, huh, for some reason it's not letting me do it. That's interesting. Theoretically you're supposed to, ah, I see. You can attack behind you, but you can't attack off the side. Now the trouble with this is that every move you make also eats away at food, or eats away at your hunger bar. So while I'm doing this, I'm getting hungrier and hungrier. I'm also really suffering from this disease, but you saw my knife skill there upgraded even though I'm not really attacking anything. Yeah, I would be dizzy too after attacking blindly in two directions. Okay, so the disease keeps getting worse. We can use a med kit here and see if we can heal up, or that's anti-venom. That's good for poison, but I don't have any, yeah, I don't have anything else for health. So let's go ahead and try the med kit and see if that helps reduce this disease. I definitely don't want to die just because of a stupid rat bite. There we go. Disease is level two. Well, this might be a total waste of a med kit. But okay, now let's just wait here. Okay, disease is reduced, and it's gone. Okay. Let's go ahead and search these rock piles, and then we'll go down a floor. Rations, awesome. Whoops. It's okay, he didn't attack. Man, he's really bad with his knife. Oh, I think he heard me, because he just... Took out two guys in one shot. That was pretty good. 
Um, over here. There we go. Okay. Now it's time to go down the floor. And hopefully we won't be outclassed too easily from doing this. Hopefully, actually, what'll happen is I'll find a bunch of equipment containers and we can um, put stuff away and okay now I haven't really found any pistol shots yet so I probably shouldn't use a pistol unless I absolutely have to if I start finding a bunch of stuff that's fine or if I get surrounded and it's a matter of survival absolutely but otherwise probably want to use my knife as much as possible at least until I find something that I can use. So armor system, now 97%, that's just my bare computer skill. Cool. This is much different than working with the marine, uh, but I just found a polymer user. Not the best thing possible. That's okay. I was really hoping to find another piece of armor, but that's probably too much to hope for. Well, I'm making these guys bleed, that's something. Armor damage, that's not great. Oh sure, the rat doesn't set off the trap. I don't even know what kind of trap that is. That is a... Oh, acid spray trap, okay. Stay away from that. Okay, so... Um... Can I put two points in finesse? I cannot. That's too bad. I'd love to be able to do that. Um, put one more into brains. We'll try to get brains up to 80, and then we'll stop dumping points into it. Uh, I'm spending a lot more time on this level up screen than I really should. So I think we're fine with foraging for now. I'm using a lot in blade and knife. This is a knife. So, push that up a little bit, pistol a little up a little bit, computer up a little bit, and not a whole lot left over. I don't even remember what biotech does. I think that determines, well, there, we'll see some consoles later that you'll use biotech. So why don't we up our lockpick, because that's important to be able to find a lot of stuff. And actually, we don't have to use all the points right away. We can just bank that point for later, and maybe it'll come in useful. So let's go to attack this rabid bat. Okay, I got some bone slivers. Oh, and we have a Zool pup. Oh, a little Zool pup. You're actually dangerous enough, I'm going to shoot you. Kind of a weak. Yeah, he's pretty weak at these weapons. Theoretically, pistol would be a finesse skill. So the sooner I get my finesse up, the better. Okay, let him come to you. Oh, and there's a rabid bat trying to sneak up on me. Boy, he's just really bad at these. Come on. He's definitely a different experience playing as the engineer. Not nearly as powerful as I got used to with the Marine. Now, of course, fists don't degrade. I could always punch things a lot. But it's probably best to save that as a finishing move. He's much better at lock picking, that's for sure. Must be more careful. Ah. Oh, infected with the disease again. So, apparently that is just is uh, determined by might. The reason my soldier wasn't getting rabies and my engineer apparently is, is because of the might score. 
So antibodies is actually an ingredient, not something I can use to fight off this disease, unfortunately. But I am pretty low on health, so using a med kit I feel is justifiable. And sure enough, took care of the disease and healed me up pretty well. Okay, what's the best route to go down here? I'm guessing... No, I don't know. It's a total guess. Uh, we'll say it's north. Now there's a Zool off to the right there, but I don't think he sees me yet. He hasn't moved. I just heard a droid. Hey, I guessed right. The way down is certainly there. So let's just make sure we have everything we can get from this area. Okay, not a whole lot there. We'll grab that foraging pod here, assuming the rat doesn't eat our face. Rats, plural, I suppose. Oh, he poisoned me. I was not expecting that. See, have rabies too. Seems very common around here. Oh, I just got degraded mite. So my mite's now 34. Hopefully that's not permanent. And I don't think it's worth using the pistol, though. Especially since I haven't found any ammo. Who needs a marine? Okay, go and search this rot pile. Okay, got some cheese. Oh, and I'm definitely hungry. That shadow boxing took more out of me than I'd like to admit. So, we can eat some pellets. And eat some rations. There we go. I'll and poison cured, great. So, I like exploring around, but I think at this point, yeah, he saw me. Okay, you can run over here, I can stab you, then we're good, okay. Um, let's upgrade might this time. We'll alternate between brains and might as we go and level up. The so traps, I don't know, it's a matter, because whenever the rats step on the trap, they don't set it off. Is it just because they're rats, or is it because enemies <laughs> don't set off traps unless you set them? That's hard to say. So we'll do lockpick, um, mechanics. I don't realize I'm putting a lot of two-point skills in here. But definitely should upgrade my knife skill, because I'm using that a lot. Um, should we just bank the other skills? Let's go ahead and put one point in foraging, because that seems really important in this early game. And I think we'll bank the other two points for now. I can always come back to the screen and spend them later if I think of it. Okay, something important comes up. So let's go ahead and go to the way down here. Oh, boy, I didn't even see you coming around that corner. I'm detected with disease again. Okay, really need to upgrade this guy's might. And sure enough, disease worsened. I don't want to go downstairs with a disease in progress. That seems like that would just be asking for trouble. Usually whenever I go downstairs, it's some kind of ambush. So we'll just be careful. Maybe something wonderful is in this freezer. Hopefully. Oh, well, rations. It's always good to carry around food. Of course, running around is probably not best for my... Yeah, I was wondering if the disease is going to worsen. Who needs a marine? Okay, we'll use a med pack. I'm rapidly running out of these, but... A med patch, maybe? Huh. Now I'll just use a med kit. See if that helps. Okay, lower the disease by one. 
we'll just wait here. See if we can get the disease to go away on its own, or if it'll worsen. Nope, it worsened. Okay, we'll just step through a lot. And are we done yet? There we go. Okay. That seemed a lot more laborious than it really should have. I don't remember my engineer getting diseased all the time. Maybe because I used the pistol more? Okay, you know what? I think I'm gonna make an exception. I wanna clear this floor and see if I can find something. So, no. sure enough, everybody and their neighbor came around as soon as I shot off that pistol. Infected again, boy. The engineer just does not have the greatest immune system. Um, I'm pretty sure that was an overkill. That was a waste of a bullet. I should have used my knife for that. Okay, he sees me. Shoot him. And then if I use my knife to stab him. Yep, that was good. And that's the trick, is not to use a weapon if it's going to do more damage to them than they have, because then you reduce the durability of your weapon for basically no reason. Okay, Pantry might have something good. And it'll give me three, tur three turns where I do nothing, which will help with the disease, theoretically. Damage Cooker, but I do have a good mechanic skill. I should be able to repair it. Not or best. not. Okay. Try this one over here. Actually, one thing I learned is you always repair from the left, because when things explode, they usually explode from the center. If you're in the left, you can usually avoid a majority of the explosion. Not necessarily all of it, but um, if you're in the center of an explosion, it's usually much harder to avoid everything. Oh, I don't even have any meat. That's hilarious. I don't know why I thought I had meat. Maybe because it drops so often when you kill bad guys, but not today. Okay, let the rat come to you, and then stab it. Oh, you missed. There you go. Hey, look, meat. Okay. I'll take that. Um, actually, with a scent gland. Now, theoretically, as the engineer, we'll come up against consoles and be able to find lots and lots of recipes as we go through the levels. But I don't think consoles actually show up in the first five levels or so. So, we will just go down as soon as we can. Okay, ice bats. We might actually be too far away from the pistol. Okay, thank you for coming closer. There we go. There was... okay. So, I want to shoot you. Okay. Oh, but I definitely don't want... Oh, yeah. The disease will infect me. Yeah, must be more careful. No kidding. Oh, out of ammo. This is gonna hurt. I don't know if I'm... T it'd be really funny if I die in the third level. Shortest let's play of this character ever. Come on, just die already. Oh, right, out of ammo. Forgot about that. Okay, he's gonna run away. That'll give me a chance to reload. And we're gonna sit here for a little bit while everyone approaches us. Okay, then theoretically the rat's gonna die. That rat's gonna die, okay. Really, the knife's down on durability already. That was fast. He's dead. I'm pretty sure that robot is just going to keep running for a little while, so I have some time. Okay, and shoot you, because that's just safer. And I got lots of pistol rounds, so I'm okay with using my pistol a little bit more often. Oh, that was only 11%. I wasn't paying attention. That was dumb. 
Okay, well, lock skill upgraded even though I didn't open it, but that's all right. Uh, I think we're just using med patch. Okay, that healed me enough. I don't want to use too much. Sure enough, he's not going to set off anything. Boy, doing worse not using the pistol. So I think I'm just going to stick to using the pistol as often as I can get away with. I should find lots of ammunition. I don't necessarily want to clear every floor, but at least enough of it where I can... Yeah, it's going to have to be a judgment call. A hey, purifier. Great, I didn't find that last time. That is very useful. So, dump in the rotten cheese make it safe. It's great. And of course, just throw it on the floor. It's what you do when you bake. You just throw things on the floor. I made a great pie. Here you go. It's on the floor. Eat it whenever you like. The contest between you and the dog. Okay. There's a giant room over here. That usually means droids of some kind. Yep, sure enough. That would be a droid. Yeah, I know there's a rat right there. We're gonna run for it here, though. Okay. Okay, if I reload... Now let's just wait for him to come over here. There we go. Okay, now if I reload... Okay, that worked. Just had to be a certain distance away. Wow, they are just coming out of the woodwork. I wonder if the security bot alerted everybody to my presence. That would kind of make sense. Could use some time to heal up here before the droid shows up. And he's gonna. Wow, that totally healed me. I was not expecting that. Okay, now he's gonna... He hasn't shown up yet. Expect him to be around the corner. Maybe he just stayed where he was. Nope, there he is. Well, I hit him. He missed me. Alright, I'm apparently doing better, though. Oh. Oh, missed. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Although he had nothing. So hopefully this room is full of wonderful goodies. Um, beds are not wonderful goodies. I mean, this ammo crate has a bunch of pistol ammo. Yes, it does. Okay. I call that worth it. And south. Yep, that's the way down. I don't know if this rat can move past this broken console. One down, two down. Alright. Can I repair that? That's a surveillance console, but it looks like it was blown up. That is well beyond my capability to repair. So, I'm going to level up. Um, yeah. Brains and finesse. And then we'll do some upgrade pistol, because that's a good skill. And let's see. I'm not sure we want to upgrade. Well, if we get this to 80, we'll get higher quality stuff in our forging. So I'll bump that up. Well, that's pretty good, up to 59. And lockpick's good. Mechanical's good. Uh, kind of hurts to spend two points in electronics, but it might be totally worth it. Actually, Decipher might be good, because we're going to be getting into... There it is. We're going to be getting into console territory pretty soon. So electronics and uh, maybe computer and Decipher. Well, computer's already at 71. 
Let's go ahead and get electronics up to the 70s. Well, almost, not quite. Okay, next floor. Okay. Oh, and I didn't reload, so hopefully these guys die all in one hit. So let's take out the ice bat first. There we go. Then that ice bat. And then this droid. Almost. I think I can just stab him for the rest of the damage. Nope. Never mind. He's going to run away, though, so not my problem. So medical locker. I can totally open that. And there's nothing in it. Okay. Well, hey, look, an ice bat. You're going to die. Nope. Not that time. There you go. Wait for him to get closer before I shoot. Upgrading the pistol skill determines how far away they are um, before you're practically guaranteed a hit. I'm pretty sure my pistol skill is not that great right now, but... no, oh, stasis field could not be dropped. That's too bad. I'm sure the game-winning item wasn't necessarily inside there, so... Still good. I think I just heard some Zool. Yep. There they are. And dead Zool. Some rats. I can probably just stab these guys. Oh, no, because it's dependent on might, and my might score is not that great. So my finesse score, though, is getting there. Okay, shoot you. There we go. Get the rabid bat to come closer. Oh, there we go. Point blank range. There we go. Now, if I were an exit, where would I be? I think it would be up and to the right. Kill you, kill you, kill you. Probably letting them get a little too close, but doing good so far. Whoa, he came out of nowhere. Okay. Another rock pile. Nope, I just saw a rat. Come over here, so I can stab you. Okay, that shouldn't have taken four hits, but for some reason it did. Duct tape. All right, that's a great repair option. I will have to remember to use my duct tape. Actually, how's my armor doing? My armor is at 51 out of 60. That's not too bad. But my knife, I wonder if I can use my duct tape to repair my knife. I can. And hey, totally worked. Just needed a little bit of duct tape on the handle, knife's totally fine now. Just like in real life, duct tape solves everything. Well, open safe. The safes are always open whenever I come by. I think all they contain is biological samples, which, of course, should require a recipe to know how to use properly. Oh, and I am starting to starve to death. That would be bad. So, let's eat some meat, and then some rations. Okay. Good enough. And maybe we'll find some more food in the rock pile. That seems to be where it's stored. Yep. There's some cheese just sitting in the rock pile. And more duct tape. That's good. Always use more duct tape. Oh, I said that the exit was up and to the right, and then where did I go? I went down. So let's kill the rat. Maybe. There we go. Droid, who's not going to run away like I was expecting. There we go. I think the bindings can be used to make frag grenades, which are really useful. Um, but I'm not sure what the recipe is, so we'll have to find a recipe for that. equipment lockers usually open. Oh, yeah, they're opened already. Okay. So 
die little rat, and then up oh, droid. Okay. I'd really like to find the way down now. Oh, for some reason, I thought he was dead. Right now. Don't know why I thought that. That is not the way down, but it is a freezer full of delicious goodness. Maybe even a pizza. Or maybe it's jammed for good. Okay, never mind. 73% should be good enough to open most locks in the early game. Okay, well, at least this is the way down. So I needed to go into this room anyway. Okay. Pop open this ammo crate, and then we'll head down. More pistol rounds. Awesome. There's a lab station here, but I don't have much in the way of recipes, I don't think. I know how to make a mine trap. Um, not a whole lot else, though. I can make a sandwich. Um, no, I can't. I don't have any cooked meat. Well, never mind then. Although I could cook some meat. I do have meat there, yes. Um, that was weird. Okay, the recipe was valid, but you failed to create. Okay. It's funny it says item unknown at the top of that, though. So never mind, my meat just disappeared into the ether. Apparently a little bit too much carbon on that barbecue. is just taking all the hits. Okay, but there's a nice console here. I have a pretty good chance of success. What the heck? Uh, well, digital assistant seems like just to add 5% seems a waste. But 94%, that's pretty good. And yep, we found a new message. So let's go ahead and try to decrypt it. 48% is not great, but hey, there we go. Got a new recipe for heavy slugs. No idea what that's used for, but... Some molecular neutronium plus shell casings plus element X makes heavy slugs. Okay, maybe that's used with a shotgun? No idea. Something spiffy, I am sure. I have done it. Okay, lots of I uh, don't want to go through the door trap. That would be bad. Well, potentially bad. Okay, don't want to go that way. Just look like probably just straight down. Yeah, I see you, little vampire bat. Okay, I think someone's going to be coming through this door any minute now. Or maybe not. Could be just the hiver trying to sneak up on me while not paying attention. Boy, he can take a lot of shots. There we go. Oop, out of ammo. It's okay, switch to my knife. Oh, shoot, that was a bad option. Because now my gun... Okay, well when I level up, I will heal completely. So all I have to do is survive. So let's go ahead and load the pistol. That'll be two turns. Well, let's stab the Zool first. Okay, Zool's dead. Out of the pistol, reload. The Hiver's probably gonna stab me. Yep, that was that's the thing that happened. And I shoot the Hiver. A bunch of times. Eventually killing it. There we go. And now I level up. Okay, that healed me to full. Great. Finesse at 60. Pretty sure that's some kind of landmark. Okay. And we will upgrade. Uh, maybe our no, knife skill, I think, is better than upgrading the blade skill. Blade skill is only 17, but knife's 55. It's moving that. Uh, only moved it at 58. That's too bad. Uh, let's upgrade foraging. And our decipher skill really needs to be boosted. 
gladly spend one point to do that. And our mechanics or our electronics. So let's get the electronics up to 70. There we go. And next time we'll do mechanics or lockpick. Okay. Zool. I'm pretty sure we can just stab him. Be great if we didn't miss. There we go. Whoa. Hello, little droid. I really wish I had an assault rifle to take him out properly. Just trading blows like that just hurt. Oh, maybe I'll find an assault rifle. Whoa. Okay, not what I expected. I might die to this mimic. Uh, yeah, wounded, grabbed. I have all of... what? Three health? Seven health. Well, okay then. I obviously have a chance then. Nope. No chance. Died. Well, okay. That was a short episode. I was not expecting that. The engineer is definitely squishy. I think maybe I should stick to the newbie character of the marine next time so that I can survive in a fight and we will level up the marine's computer skill and brains so that we have a fighting chance. I have no idea how I made it to level 17. Oh, I know how I did it. Because <laughs> of easy mode. The engineer on normal mode is apparently a little bit more than I can handle right now. I am someone new to this. I only have, what, six hours put into this game, so later on when I have 60, I'll know all the things there are to know, but I am not there yet. So, thank you for joining me on our quest to get to level 30. Sadly, we level, made it to level 5 today, but things change. We'll do better next time. That's how it happens. So, thank you for joining me. I'm a piece of the universe. So are you. And good night.